We are back 840. We're with a fashion beauty and pop icon, Victoria Beckham. She kind of does it all. Yeah, she <laughs> always seems so posh, so put yeah. together. The co-founder well. and creative director of Victoria Beckham Beauty and her own clothing line. And we just want to say before we begin, we've tried out your makeup. Yeah, we're it was, wearing it. We are totally into it. It must have been a fun thing to create. Well, firstly, you are both glowing, ladies. <laughs> I have to say, you look gorgeous this morning. So we were fishing for that. Yeah. Oh, gosh, it really is a dream mm. for me to be creating a luxurious fashion and mm -hmm. beauty house of the future is, mm. is a dream. I feel so blessed and so mm -hmm. lucky to have a job that I just love so much. Yeah, you, you know what I love about you, Victoria? Because you are posh, we know yeah. that. And then, you know, you always have that, like, mm -hmm. like elegant look about you here you are in Paris walking the runway come on it's your you had a moment mm -hmm. and I loved it because you were mm -hmm. totally overwhelmed with gratitude and joy in that moment you yeah. I think you said you were like hoping to have some like moment where you're just like doing the catwalk and here you are yeah. what were you thinking uh, in these moments you know I was so emotional because it's such a big deal mm. for me to have a show in Paris, it was a real highlight mm. of my career. I had my family there, mm. I had my friends there, and I felt so proud of my team. Mm. I really did. And I was planning on coming out and having a very yeah. cool picture taken, yeah. and I just broke down <laughs> when I saw my husband and my children who mm. are so supportive of what I do. I was just very, very happy. You know, it's so awesome. You're surrounded by all these people who love and adore you. Speaking of your uh, adorable husband, we were just in London for the Queen's funeral, and in that long, winding line, there was your husband waiting hours and hours and hours just to pay his respects. Uh, tell us about that, that decision. You know, David felt very, very humbled by the experience. Mm. It was something that he really wanted to do, and he is so happy that he did it. He said the mm -hmm. experience was something that he, he struggles to even express. Mm. It meant so much to him. He was in that queue for 14 hours. Mm. He said he met some really amazing people. Yeah. He was buying them all donuts. <laughs> <laughs> he said, I met some great, great people, uh -huh. and he's just so happy he did it. Mm. I mean, it's just amazing. You guys, by the way, have you been married 23 years? 23 years. Four kids. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And one of your, what, is it your daughter or your son just got married? Brooklyn. Brooklyn just yeah. got married. Oh. Who, by yeah. the way, cooked here once with I us. Know. He did such a great job. I know. Oh, thank you. Yeah, mm -hmm. it was a beautiful wedding. And as a mother, to see my son so happy um, means so much. Mm. What more can you ask for? You can't ask for one more thing. And what about, I mean, you're still a parent, which is kind of interesting. I always wonder about, you know, when you parent grown kids. Yeah. What is that like for you in this moment? Do you know, I think that the kids grow up so, so quickly. Yeah. And it's about cherishing every moment and mm -hmm. we're a very close family it's all about communication mm -hmm. um and being present as a parent i love to work i love what i do mm -hmm. in fashion and beauty but being a parent being a good mom mm -hmm. is my number one job mm. um <laughs> they're amazing they work hard mm -hmm. they're good sweet kind human beings and mm -hmm. i think that that's what you want to do as a parent yeah, well definitely but it's not easy to pull off when both parents are in the mm -hmm. public eye and mm -hmm. international celebrities like how did you yeah. keep them grounded you know I think it's just being close and having good mm -hmm. family around us my parents and and David's parents and mm -hmm. you know just talking to them about everything mm. you know we always say that this is an environment where we can talk and mm. communicate open yeah we're very very present you know yeah. the kids are they're happy hard-working respectful kids and mm -hmm. that's what you want uh, a lot of people are watching this interview and they only want one question answered, and that is when is the Spice Girls reunion? So why don't you just go ahead go and, and tell us, tell us again? Well, yeah. There, there, there isn't going to be a reunion. No, <laughs> Wait, I mean, forever? No, you know, so I, you're saying there's a chance. <laughs> no, I, no, what I mean is that I'm so thankful to the yeah. girls and so yeah. grateful to the fans and the amazing career that, that we all had. Mm. But I think that, you know, now I'm, I'm, I'm so into yeah. what I'm doing with fashion sure. and beauty beauty and the children. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm just not so sure I could do anymore. Well, can I just say, though, that your husband, David, did post a couple of videos, and yeah. I just want to say that you still have it. You're singing. Do you, yeah. do you see, did you authorize <laughs> these? Because it's like, did he say, turn yeah. the sound on. I think we have the video. We can show yeah. some yeah. of it.
Okay, there she goes. <laughs> okay, it's happening. What was your number? That's karaoke. What was your song? Well, it turns out it's a bit of a party trick. So though I'm not going to go back on tour, <laughs> I really, you know, I can do a bit, bit of karaoke. Yeah. It always goes down a storm, by the way. Yeah, I bet. I it love does. It. I love it. And also, people still dress up as y'all for, for Halloween. Wait, How many years later? your mic. That is not yeah. right. <laughs> do you know they always used to do that to me? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> they always used to do that to me. Um, yes. yes, Halloween and the Spice Girls. I mean, I think it's the ultimate, um, yeah. the ultimate compliment when anybody wants to dress up as you. Yeah, at Halloween, right? It'll be that forever. Uh, congratulations on all the wonderful things you do, and the new makeup so line, yeah. which is kind of sparkly and and fun for the holidays yeah. too. Well, I can see you're wearing the new um, Kajal eyeliner, oh. which looks gorgeous. Let me oh, you. thank you, Emma. Oh, yes, it, yes it you are so, so sparkly. Yeah. I mean, the Kajal eyeliners. Honestly, there's you, no product like it. People love 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 those kajal so i'm excited by that launch but i have to say just i am so happy to be in new york mm. the vibe here yeah. and the atmosphere yes. i haven't been here for a while it is so good it's to be back and see people yes. out right oh, yes. well, new york loves you too yeah love you, you right back in here look at the paparazzi out the window i know they, they're ne all wait, here. they never come they don't yeah they were like why are they here it's not we're, us did we do we're, something we're like no. did we say something oh. do something it's like no they're just all outside the window you gather a crowd in the best way thank you thank you and you'll stick around and talk to me in the fourth hour okay, I, would I look love forward to, to that you. hey thanks for watching our YouTube channel find your favorite recipes celebrity interviews uplifting stories shop our favorite deals and so much more with the today app download it now